Ciao, this is Mark Martantonio. Today's short video is going to show you how to, I set up my AquaView Pro, uh, it's a MultiView Pro 2 camera system, underwater camera system, and it, uh, I use it for scouting areas and finding fish. It, uh, it's amazing the amount of information you can gain from using an underwater camera. What's nice about the HDS Pro units, as well as the carbons and lives, um, is that it has a video feature that you can display the image from your camera system right onto the HDS system. Now, when the new pros came out, the Ethernet, I'm sorry, the HDMI port on the back, which is what I use to send the camera image to the HDS Pro, apparently they, the software didn't include the software for the uh, HDMI port to work correctly. So when I first got my Pro and hooked it up to my camera, I had no images, which was really uh, dis disconcerting. So I checked with uh, customer service, called customer service, and they said, yes, they know it's a, it's a known issue with the original software version for the HDS Pros and that the software version coming out next would, would take care of it. And that's software update number 23.3, .3, which I've already uploaded to my HDS Pro. So it has now been updated to the HDS Pro 23.3 .3 software update. Now let's see if they in fact did fix the video um, portion. So I'm going to go ahead and press the video. The video source is HDMI, and there we go. We got the camera. It's working just fine. So they did, in fact, fix the HDMI input for the um, HDS Pros with the new software update. So I hope that helps. If you're not using an underwater camera, in conjunction with all of the great features of side scan, forward scan, down scan, regular sonar, 3D sonar, then I highly recommend adding an underwater camera to your setup and you'll have a lot more fun and catch a lot more fish. This is Mark Marcantonio. Ciao.